what up guys your boy jmat95 with another video now today's video is a car maintenance video so we're gonna go outside we're gonna pop the hood go outside and i'll show you guys what the issue is okay so popping the hood now i was at a rt life's car meet and i popped my hood to show srt life who's another guy at the car meet and looking under the hood you know he pointed out to me that my coolant level was low so if you look here this is a coolant for anyone who doesn't know and there's two lines on there there's up here it says cold fill range which is you know it should be from my understanding it should be no lower than this line so what I'm gonna do now I try going to advance and get some coolant but they didn't have any coolant for this this is a yeah, I guess it's a special Mopar coolant because the store didn't have any so if you guys watch my oil change video you guys would have seen where we went into apps for like a vehicle maintenance guy we went into apps um, hair user guide and then it tells you what kind of fluids you need so I was using that for the oil change fluid and here it says vehicle maintenance let's click on that and then I, with the whole mix up about what you know coolant to get I just came in here I was like oh yeah my car has a user guide so I came in here I did fluid and capacities general was it this one I think it was this one uh, yep fluids and loose 3.6 liter engine and boom now we're in the engine coolant and here it says you know antifreeze coolant 10 air 150,000 mile formula OAT the key thing was the OAT the organic additive technology um, another way too if you can't find it you just click search and you just type in coolant so the purple one they did have it wasn't OAT I, I really don't remember all these terms that he was saying it's, you know but um, so point is we're gonna go over to the dealer and have them check the coolant out and you know top it off basically see how much that costs hopefully it doesn't cost an arm and a leg so I'll see you guys over there and I don't know how much I'll be able to film but I'll let you know guys I'm here at the dealership now you see it right there South Shore service which is South Shore Dodge Chrysler Jeep so I'm gonna go inside right now and see how much they're charging for this coolant or how much it is to you know get this thing fixed all right guys I bought the coolant this is the coolant they gave me Mopar concentrate antifreeze coolant and concentrate means I have to mix it so I have to mix it with distilled water, 50, half and half, 50 coolant, 50 water. So um, when I get home, I'm going to ahead put in a bottle and mix it and top it, top it off. So the dealer recommended that I use distilled water because the antifreeze coolant is concentrated. So again, you have to mix it 50-50. So distilled water or deionized water is the preferred water to use when putting it into your engine or mixing it with the coolant so you look at it i emptied it to about a little bit below the quarter mark so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna add 50 percent of this to well not 50 percent of the whole bottle but you know add it to where it's half water and half coolant
dodge to get the concentrated Mopar because I couldn't get it, uh, advanced order parts. I didn't bother to check orders on. But this ran me about $30, $30, $32 after taxes or whatever, depending on your state. Thank you very much for watching. And like, comment, subscribe if you guys have any comments, questions, concerns, or any tips for me. You know, leave it in the comment box. I'll respond, I'll get back to you. Um, and also, you know, I'm doing this video to teach you guys something and hopefully, so hopefully you guys learn something from me or if there's anything you guys want to teach me, you know, just put it down in the comment because, you know, we're all not perfect. And that's what I'm all about, learning. That being said, this video is over.